The nature of the church is a complex and multifaceted concept within Christianity, and it can be understood from various theological, biblical, and practical perspectives. Here are some key aspects of the nature of the church. Ecclesia, the called out assembly of the word church, is derived from the Greek word ecclesia, which means the called out assembly or gathering. It signifies that the church is a community of believers who are called out of the world to come together for worship, fellowship, and the fulfillment of God's purposes, the body of Christ in the New Testament. The church is often described as the body of Christ. This metaphor emphasizes the unity and interconnectedness of believers with Christ as the head. Each member of the church has a unique role and function within the body. Worship and fellowship, the church serves as a place for worshiping God. Collectively and for believers to come together in fellowship, corporate worship includes activities such as singing hymns, prayer, and the celebration of the Lord's Supper communion. Teaching and discipleship, the church is responsible for teaching and nurturing the faith of its members. This includes biblical teaching, discipleship, and spiritual growth. Pastors, teachers, and leaders play a crucial role in this aspect. Mission and outreach the church is called to carry out the Great Commission, which is to make disciples of all nations, Matthew 281,920. This involves evangelism, spreading the message of Jesus, Christ, and engaging in social and humanitarian activities to serve the community. Sacraments and ordinances The church typically practices sacraments or ordinances, such as baptism and the Lord's Supper which symbolize and commemorate key aspects of the Christian faith. Unity and diversity, the church is a diverse community with people from different backgrounds, cultures, and traditions. Despite this diversity, there is an emphasis on maintaining unity in faith and love. As stated in the New Testament Ephesians 43, church leadership churches are often organized with a leadership structure, including pastors, elders, deacons, and other roles to provide spiritual guidance, oversee the church's activities, and care for the congregation. Local and Universal Church The church has both a local and universal dimension. Local churches are individual congregations that meet in specific locations, while the Universal Church encompasses all believers worldwide who share a common faith in Jesus Christ. The church's relationship with Christ ultimately the nature of the church is grounded in its relationship with Jesus Christ. Christ is considered the cornerstone of the church, Ephesians 220, and the church's purpose is to glorify God and fulfill His mission in the world. It's important to note that different Christian denominations may have nuanced understandings of the nature of the church, and there can be variations in how these aspects are emphasized and practiced within various traditions. The essence of YouTube is to subscribe and like.